you guys do any temp probes before I came on watch? We did some temp probes. What were you seeing? Threes? Yeah. Yeah, the bars is in a... What do we say, like 305? Or 314. 314? 314. Yes. Uh, so the bar should be somewhere below you. Yeah. Yeah, I see the cable below me. Yeah. That's almost 600 degrees Fahrenheit. <clears throat> yeah. Okay, there's 2267 meters depth. I guess I'll look at these spires now and go to yeah. their entire summit, which is not so bad. Actually, I haven't looked at this one yet, I don't believe. Uh, you mean like tucked around this around way this and going way. up? Yeah, yeah, might as well get that. While we're here. We're thinking of you, Tom. Thinking of that post processing. Yeah. And you're going to be like, oh, this side's all blurry. <laughs> Not today, Tom. Not today. Not today. He's just pulling his hair out. <laughs> like, we're doing all the wrong things. <laughs> but we're confidently like, yep, just yep, doing it for it. Tom. <laughs> Good old Tom. <laughs> All right, that's that one. That one's a lot shorter. The shorter ones go faster. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna have to get back on the science of that, but. Yeah. I haven't checked your math yet, but. Seems that way. Seems anyway. that way, yeah. I don't know if there's a paper on that yet, but you could write it. Paper trail. There's the bars. Bars, bars are below us? Yeah, right yeah. in the uh, 2267. Porch cam. So still deeper than, oh, there's the black smoke right underneath me right now. Yeah, yeah. You, should, you should sit on that. 1721.39. Negative <laughs> 2.7 degrees pitch. 2.7 pitch, Roger. This is probably not very photogrammetrical, so I'm going to no, just no. not include the smoke. Unless you could make a, a fake 3D, cloud, yeah. 3D photogrammetry smoke plume, that would be pretty nifty. You could, it would just be just quite blurry because it changes. You don't know that. Sure. Sure I do. <laughs> I think I'm making <laughs> it right staring now. right at of, it. Kind of, that's how it is. <laughs> can you prove it though? Okay, uh, uh, I think we can get some clear view over here. Yeah, wait for the fog to clear there. You should Ooh. sit on the vent, though. I'll try sitting on the vent. Yeah. You ever seen that sphere light that we have that was melted by a vent like oh, yeah. 10 years ago and it still works somehow? Where did that go? I tried to show it to somebody I was, and it I think couldn't find it. I, think I believe I was there, if I'm not mistaken, when it was. It was on the. Oh, starboard side, it was all grayed out. It was like... It was on the brow at that not, time. Not quite 10 yeah. years ago. 2268, that's enough. 172301. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> We've all got numbers. Uh, I'm going to get a DVL reset. Okay. Just to keep my line straight here. Just to keep you busy. Yeah, not doing anything else. <laughs> Bothering you with numbers, might as well do something. Do you want to move our, our, our Atlanta now? Ready for it? <laughs> okay. <Yeah. laughs> Bridge now. Can we step 10 meters west? Thank you. I think we're insane, but hopefully he's watching. Otherwise, it'd be. 
be boring to not watch this. Okay. Um, can I sidle up to the side of the sidle thing? I think like, at the back yeah, side sidle of this? in the saddle. Yeah. Let me just have a look. Side saddle. Side salad? Sidle side. Side salad. I'm gonna <laughs> I am gonna go down the far side of the short one. Okay. And then I'll come back to the tall one. Roger. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes most sense. Get the most most bang for my yeah. I think we're we're making pretty good time, so yeah. yeah. Look at all these other spires beside me here. Woo Mama. Sidle saddle spire. Side side saddle. Side side salad. Side salad. <laughs> Your side saddle, side saddle. Yeah, it's kind of as tucked in as I want to get with all those yeah, yeah. side spires. Side spires can't get too in there unless you feel inspired. The spire will be in me. You know what we need? We need like a spiky oh, oh. dog collar to go on the bars. Oh, yeah. Unless you're going to say a mute button. Oh, yeah, I was, I was coming for a mute or... All right, I'm too deep. See ya. Coming back up. 2269.5. Dog shop collar for me and Trevor to stop doing what we're doing. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid joke. Zap. <laughs> All right. All right, now we're on this spire. We're on this. This is the one we're on. 1725.41. Who gets the remote? Each other. Yeah. Happen <laughs> 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 each other. Coming up. This is great. Oh, two and a half meters. Yeah. AJ, your three and a half meters is killing me. It doesn't feel right. It's wrong. What? Well, this one is just really. Heidi? It's yeah, but it's also like not yeah, entirely think. straight. It's got like a it's kind of bendy on the way up. It's a ton of flow <laughs> in there if you look at the tube worms. So. Yeah, yeah. Oh. You come down over here where it's dangerous. Yeah, it was the horse. Three and a half meters. No saddle on that horse, though. Mm. What was it eating? Another tether, feeling. It's kind of like going away from the yeah. spires. Yeah, looks that's, like that's a happy way. Happy way. Marley, how you doing back there? I'm fine. I'm Good. just fine. looking at comments from people who oh, no. think they know a lot more than our ROV pilots. Uh -oh. but, yeah, uh, <laughs> yeah they're, they're telling us. <laughs> I don't know anything. Thing. All right. We're just going to ignore those and uh, let y'all keep doing what you're doing. Yeah, guarantee they know more than me. Yeah. yeah. Could do just about anything you wanted if it wasn't for that pesky umbilical. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I don't want to go farther there. Maybe I can go a little farther. Farther? What do you mean? Like you could tell? You could run? Oh, I, I think there's one more pass on this big boy. <laughs> oh, I see what you mean. Going this way. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah but you're. Yeah. Well, you know, give it I a think little. I can sidle. Yeah. Side salad up to it. Side salad up to it. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So to the viewers at home, we don't have just have this one ROV that we're uh, maneuvering around here. We do have a secondary ROV that's floating above as you can see in one of your uh, views if you're on the quad and that is essentially just dangling from the ship um, and then there's a softer umbilical between that and Hercules but in these hot vent fluids and um, 
kind of spires. We don't want to tangle that tether anywhere near them. Well, so that's kind of what we're dealing with here. Um, trying to close. do a dance. Now we could do that all really safely, um, but it would take a long time if we were to kind of spread those two out and circumnavigate this feature, but we're trying to exploit as best we can the amount of time, um, and mini which means minimal movements because we are in 2200 meters of water. So anytime you're gonna move that ship to move the secondary ROV, will take uh, quite a bit of time for that movement to translate all the way down that cable. Trevor, did you see that iris jump as you were coming up there? Yes. Yeah, so that's, you know, rolling it smooth and the comms hang that's what we're pursuing roger does not happen on the bench roger okay that was way way too close on that starboard side see again mm -hmm. yeah i'm backing away and i'm turning to starboard and i'm going to go down the down yeah. the spire to my right try to keep it in view so we don't yeah there we go we never lost it yeah now that i've cleaned the whole side of it off with the uh stitch starboard side of the vehicle. Yeah. Okay, um, can I get bubble on the port side, please, again? Thank you. Do you want your port cam up? Yeah. Do yeah, I do. Double starboard. You can go down. Yeah, yeah, exactly right there. Perfect, thank you. And then so the shape of this feature on the seafloor is kind of... <clears throat> That's perfect. Thank you. Uh, it's not It's not quite <clears throat> a single point. It's kind of more of a ridge-like. So we have to place vehicles smartly in order to optimize time. Can't really put it in the center because the length of the tether doesn't allow for that if we were to spiral down, which was a lot of what the conversation was before. But ultimately, there's many ways to do this. And we're just trying to choose the one that is going to be quickest and gets us the best data. And least <coughs> melty. And less melty, the safest for the vehicles. Yeah, I'm not sure how we well have indeed are. come up. We've recovered uh, the vehicle, and there, despite all best practices, there was a burn mark in the tether because <clears throat> it was lost in the smoke and apparently sitting on a hot spot, which would be bad if it burned through. I melted some rubber bumpers on a different ROV system last year. Yeah. I was here with a different ROV that had a negative tether. Yeah. Hey, Rennie. Yes. Could we give a little bit of background on uh, how this type of structure forms and <laughs> why we're doing yeah. photogrammetry on it? Is that yeah. going to interrupt your comms too much? Uh, a That's resident it geologist. <clears throat> it might interrupt my uh, capability. To <laughs> <laughs> um, <clears throat> uh, <laughs> heavy size. Mineral rich starts. fluid is being emitted from the seafloor, it's heated uh, from the earth. And as it precipitates out, it uh, <coughs> can create these spires by a process of <coughs> elimination. <laughs> process. Please type in Wikipedia as fast as he yeah. can uh, over there. No, Rennie, sorry. I was asking if we in the back row could talk for a minute oh, about yeah, it. Oh, yeah, sorry. I <laughs> thought you were asking. <laughs> well, you don't have to be like, the <laughs> resident expert. I was like, sorry. excuse me? No, I was enjoying your right. 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 You're doing it. great, oh. though. I have nothing to contribute, so Rennie. Yeah. <laughs> AJ's right. got well, the... Well, that wasn't clear to me, or I'm dumb. <laughs> I'm just trying not to interrupt your operational <laughs> communication. Fantastic. Marley, Thank I you, love Marley. how you let him go. Yeah, that was <laughs> to stop me at any point. Yeah, every, every part of that I loved. He's a smart Quality guy. timing was perfect. Yeah. yeah. All right, we're going to pass the mic to AJ now. <laughs> well, I don't have nearly the same amount of information, but Tom Kushishna, our resident scientist on this, uh, has said that uh, these have grown 10 <laughs> meters in 10 years. Is oh, the wow. In which they grow. Yeah, so we had a question about how long does it take for these types Can of structures to form. Can I get one, please? Yeah. 
So that is pretty quick. <laughs> There's a lot of flow here. Super funny. Yeah, I'm just going to land right in the vent and melt. <laughs> this site was huh. surveyed in 1997, 2014, and 2015. And so using those three surveys and hopefully this one, we'll be able to better understand the rate of growth and how these towers change over time. Were each of those, like, does survey mean photogrammetry model yep. each time? Yeah, that's awesome. Incoming. The photogrammetry is done by our colleagues at Geomar in Germany. Just buzz the tower here, I think. Yeah. So you see that tether? It's kind of like that. Yeah, that's what you want, I'd, I'd say. Yeah, as long so as I we're want. as long as this ends. Far, yeah, I think we're all right. All right. Here comes a surprise. Whoa. Hello. That is surprising. Hi. It, Okay, so now I've come down as far on that back one as I can go. I'll back away and do this little shorty. Try to keep it in the frame. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just gonna do all of the things. The whole the whole tower, all the sides. I'm <coughs> Watch your uh, port side there. Thank you. We don't. We lost port cam again. Yeah, I switch it back and forth every time I remember. Yeah. Okay, down to what was that number? Twenty-seven sixty-eight was conservatively. Yep, there, you yeah. can see everything. Come around and do the middle here. There's going to be a lot of imagery to join together to make a oh photogrammetry man. model. I hope it's automated. Yeah. That's why they do it every five years, because it takes that long to stitch it together. Yeah. yeah. I hope, can you imagine if they had to, it's manual, print it out and like decoupage it? <laughs> around them. Like putting together the uh, paper shredder <laughs> documents? Yeah. 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 How many mass does it take? Yeah. You know, if you really enjoy jigsaw puzzles, there's a career path for you. Yeah. <coughs> Another quick science question. Will these keep growing up forever or will they eventually collapse? I'll, I'll field that. <laughs> <laughs> Over to our chief scientist, Renato Kane. <laughs> yes, forever. All the way. <laughs> I think Event's biggest natural predator is the ROV. Yeah. 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 The bars. Seems that way. Yeah, it just depends if the heat source continues or not. If the plumes are still active and the chimneys are still uh, active, then they're going to keep causing um, growth. But if the heat source oh. turns off for a bit or cools down, never lost it down there. then no. a chimney can become inactive and eventually it can erode and crumble. Yeah, it's, it's all about the heat source. Thank you, May. Thanks, May. Yeah, well done. Sometimes the heat source moves around, so you'll have one chimney that's really active for many years and then turns off, and another one sort of comes up nearby, and then it starts to grow another chimney. But um, So when the heat source turns off is when the erosion starts? We could move well, here it's, if you want. It's We're slowly back, right? kind of crumbling no all the time. Right. Um, there's a lot of biological growth you, on these chimneys. So you can see they're covered in little tube worms and, and other mm -hmm. stuff. But, Maybe you're here. Um, those two worms are attracted to the chimney because of the fluids. So if a chimney is no longer uh, emitting fluids or um, emits more diffuse fluid and there's less animals that are interested in living there, then eventually it'll kind of crumble, but can get knocked over or um, by so the ROV as does well. all of that biology, like the two worms and everything else, is that kind of what helps to maintain the structure? Um, it's, it's, it, it can help to some degree, but it can also cause the structure to kind of have, uh, more growth in some area and maybe mm -hmm. it'll be like less stable in, in some part, but it also just depends on the types of chemicals that are coming out of the, the chimney, um, and what's being emitted 
which will sort of dictate how cr crumbly the structure is, the material of the chimney itself. I think there's going to be a bit of a blind spot in this kind of tower. Yeah, we can't so get in there. Can't, yeah, I don't. <coughs> so I mean, it's as not good responsibly. As it's yeah. So. Or, yeah. We remove. She'll go, but. We could remove part of it in order to get in there. Yeah. That's about it, yeah. A little close there, but I don't think I can back up. I think something behind me ish. What are you? Have we gone off the side of this thing yet? I don't think so. Uh, I don't. Well, I just go here, for it. If, yeah, we can go for it, but what just watch your, watch your butt. Yeah, I'm not going to go down anymore. Yeah, okay, good. I think we did on the other side. Yeah, I think um, so too, but I don't think we've been up this side. But might as well get another vantage. This would be a risky thing to go case. down on. Don't do that. Yeah, totally. Uh, It'll be cold low. at this height, but. Yeah. Yeah. Not going to melt the vehicle. Well, then what are we down here for, then? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, get a little Baton. of that to the left. You see how it is a bit yeah, more? Yeah, I see it. Yeah, yeah, there you go. It's really confusing, the. <laughs> yeah. The altitude is very weird. It's flying up. Getting pushed up like crazy. It's really cool. I don't know that I want to be here forever. Yeah, it looks like we got four sides of this. Yeah, cool, no, great. The way that that looks. Which is yeah, right. I'm not going to go back down in this because that's no. uh, asking for trouble. Um, yeah, but okay, I got to back away. Back away. This vehicle is going to stink when we recover it, I think. DVL reset. Sulfur. Yeah. I'm still in flow. You're probably still going to get messy DVL. Yeah, I know, definitely. I'm just kind of constantly. Yeah, Roger. Here's another surprise for you. <coughs> no, don't. Yeah, don't Kinda unbox like it yet. Ready? Okay. Here it comes. Surprise. Peekaboo! Whoa, that's that? bright. Brow. Morning, Ed. Yeah. I'm getting pulled. Brow. At my uh, my limit. Yeah, why don't you back away? Get away from me. I'm here, I'm going up and down, giving you a wrist workout. So, I did move. I think uh, I have one more little chimney over here to do, if I'm keeping track correctly. Uh, 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 yeah, yeah. This, this zone. This uh, zone. That's and annoying. Also, but. this here might be good to do if once we got Atlanta. Yeah, farther, it's coming you know? It's coming a bit. Yeah, great. Because I couldn't really get there. I could even go back down deep. Yeah, yeah. I might as well. <coughs> Will be irresponsible not to. Mm -hmm. Weird little white line looks like the snow line on mountains. Yeah. There's still stuff below me, too. Man, that was an end. I just don't know how they did that. Like, went around it. Oh, with the graphics? Well, no. Maybe it was a single body. I don't know. Oh, I don't know. Let's move the ship a lot. Take it easy. I guess, yeah. It did take much longer than... than it took hours and hours, and we've only done it for, yeah. like, an hour. Right. 17.42.59. Yeah. Approximately. Um... I'm going deeper now because I'm going to go to the bottom of this big boy. Roger. And uh, that's not that. Cut piece. That's the cut piece, yep. Yeah. A little off the top, please. And then I think this is kind of the ending. So if I go up this side, down the other side, I think I'm. Yeah. That's it, right? Mm -hmm. Am I missing anything? Uh, Sounds like a question for Science Row, too. Uh, yeah, you could get more around because can I see where we... Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Go yeah. up and then, and then more come around, around and come more down. Around. Yeah, that seems like it. Okay, coming up. Um, AJ, Let's now that... So I moved Adelanta a little more on this side. We could potentially get a lower bit on this western flank, if you like, on the on the way out. Yeah, sure. This is the side that...
we sort of didn't quite get to at 2271. Exactly. Yeah, so I went down, I started this most recent vertical transect at 2272 or whatever. That's yeah. precarious right there. Yeah. Come around a little bit and then. So for this photogrammetry, is it all tied in, or all the images tied to the uh, gyro data for heading for pitch and roll to help feed into that algorithm, or is it all just image-based? I think this method is just image-based, if I'm not mistaken. Wow. Maybe, cool. I'm, maybe I am, though. Okay. Tom is typing. Maybe Tom's, he'll be able to give you an yeah. answer. Do we have different ways of doing it. We've done photogrammetric surveys that also include multi-beam sonar. Right. We have an ROV mounted multi beam. <coughs> um, we've done it before with. I think Roman had a had lasers. Yeah. Like um, the scanning lasers. Yeah, the scanning uh, lasers like that were mounted close to the seafloor. Yeah, totally. Uh, right on the bottom of the ROV. Uh, you can do it just by traditional like structure for motion or photogrammetry, but I don't know how well constrained your uh, dimensions are. Right. Um, ROV Tom is saying that left of the cut stump is a ridge that was probably missed. So first get the main structure, but then maybe we can go back and get uh, a ridge left, on the left of the side cut, of stump. That cut stump. Pretty sure I got that, but let's check. Yeah, we can Do always it. get it again. Look at that hole. Yeah. Always get it again. Yeah, that is a really cool. The bottom of this feature is amazing. Yeah, it's just I'm barely assuming, hanging on. I'm assuming we're talking about this white one here. Maybe he means from this Oh, from this angle, too. I see. So, like, vehicle kind of position near the top of the cut stump yeah, maybe. and looking at this yeah. ridge. Yeah, I'll do that. <coughs> no problem. I think that's a good catch. I think I did miss that. I went so up, yeah, I went up the top, far side. I think so, up. yeah. Good call. Tom's comment on the use of the navigation is that the better the nav, the more likely you can use it. Often you initialize without the navigation. Yeah. So I guess it, yeah, it depends on cool. the cleanliness of the data as to whether or not it's usable. But sounds Great. like he gets it, looks at it, and uses could it potentially use it. Yeah. Nice. Look at the thinness of that ridge over there, just on the right side. So cool. Yeah. AJ, can I toss out another science question? Sure. For We've got several people, it sounds like, who are just tuning in and wondering what exactly we're looking at. So can you just give us a quick definition of what a hydrothermal vent is and uh, why ONC is really interested in studying this area and these types of features? Oh, man. Marley, I'm, I really feel ill-qualified <laughs> to answer this question. Megan or any other. Rennie. <laughs> Rennie. Chief scientist Rennie. <laughs> okay. Are we done before we answer the question? Are we, uh, or on the, uh, do we want to do a low pass on the way out? Just a quick general overview is fine. Oh, that's right. Low pass. Yeah. I think we got that with the stills cam. I think that was the. Um, yes. There. So, yeah, what do you want to do on the way out? Hang on. Yeah. We might just need to plan the rest of the dive. Oh, for yeah, a that's fine. Here. Yeah, take your time. <laughs> also, give me a moment <laughs> just to think about how to answer the question. Way to say totally it. fine. <laughs> I'll just ask Tom if he has any final requests. Roger. got a lot of operational logistics conversation happening right now. We'll get Doing back to questions in a minute. Pilot swap here. What is this? 1969? Hello, everybody. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. 
Okay, Renny, I was told to ignore you, so. Yep. Whatever I say, don't do it. Just below me? Yeah. So. Yeah. Roger. All right, one final request from Tom before we leave the area. Roger. Um, he would just like to get the small ridge to the south from both sides. Small ridge to the south from both sides. So if we look at nav, the furthest extent to the south. Right. Yeah, exactly. And from both sides, he means. So this side and the other side. This. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I thought we got that from both, but we could. Well, we could reposition. Uh, we might be able to go and, and try to. Okay. So. Yeah, I mean we're gonna go have to shoot down here. here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Going along there. Yeah. And this is going to be a ridge or something. Maybe. Yeah, down just like the, this perspective here, mm -hmm. if you're looking at it, sure. and we'll try to get all around it. Roger. Um. I think Atalanta should give you enough because we did move it quite a bit now. I could He's bump uh, down. Clarifying, it's the small dark thing south of the cutoff stump. South. Like actual south direction from the cutoff? Yeah, sorry. I think okay. so. So we'll go back to the cutoff stump, which is somewhere around here. Yeah. Okay. <coughs> How long is the swim tether? 45 meters? Is that what it was? 50 40? 50 50 50 zero. 50 50 meters. Are we supposed to be staying kind of up above yeah. this? No, we can go down to it at this point. Sorry, go ahead, Dave. I didn't mean to interrupt you. Sorry, are we staying high or are we coming back down a bit? I think we're going to be coming back down if I if the, the feature that he's speaking of is what I'm thinking of. Okay. Um, back down to the cut stump at least, and then we'll orient. I'll start coming in slow behind you anyway, mate. Roger. <coughs> so once we get a visual there of the cut stump, which I don't see. Cut stump. It's like a flat top. So if you pan, if you kind of like go to port a bit, maybe we'll see it. There, that's that cut stump right there in the bottom left corner. You see how it's kind of flat? Bottom left. And yeah. that's where we're going? Um, I don't... Is this the ridge that he's talking about d dead ahead in front of us? We did get it. I think from both sides, but the other one was on the other, all the way around to the other extent. We've got to watch uh, there. we got the tether. It should be okay, but... Yeah, you'll be fine. I've got you, mate. Okay, Raj. Uh, what do, where are we going here? What are we doing? Yeah, I want to check in there with, uh, with AJ. Um, so we have the cut stump in the bottom left corner. Mm -hmm. Is yeah. it this feature direct dead ahead that he's interested in? Yeah. Okay. I think so. Um, so I think we got it. Yeah. Well, this may be a, a tie-in piece because we got it from the other side many we've frames ago. But yeah, we've definitely done this one before as well. Yeah. Because I remember this tether angle. I think angle. we started at this one on the right on side. On the other side, yeah. yeah. And then came yeah. around and did it. But we could try we to... Just do a quick up-down on both sides. Yeah. So we're right here. Up-down on we this side and then an up-down on that yeah. side. Yeah. Just do that in case, uh, in case it ties it in better. Just... Just start make sure. at the bottom or the top, or nobody cares? You can start where you are. Start where I am, but I'm in the middle. <laughs> Back in the middle. Okay, so gotcha. Uh, That's going to be, be all right. Real. It'll be tight. Don't go round it, though. Come yeah, down. Don't, yeah. okay. don't go round. All right, okay. all right. Roger. Yeah, I can just make out the, the tether there. Yeah, we're okay. Stay on this side of it. Yeah. How far off are we? Go ahead, come. Is, what do we call on the bottom? Back. Yeah, yeah, and then you can just come up it. Okay. Six, six, I think, was bottom, wasn't it? That was our middle, I think. 
Yeah, I think I think it was 20, 2270 was the lowest uh, pass we did, and then oh, they yeah, were using the DS. Yeah, 2271, yeah. Yeah, we, so we are down. Yeah, we're we're good. Okay. Right. I know we got the other side on the right, so this should be fine. I yeah. don't think we need to go farther right, and we also can't without a ship move. I don't think. Roger. <coughs> Oh, that's a pretty one, too. Well, that's a good one right there. It just keeps wow. going, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. That one's so cool. Yeah, that's awesome. All right, come around this side? Yeah. Okay. Come down it. I just don't need to keep you quite tight here, Mitt. Roger. Seems the, seems all right. All the pace inside, yeah. Mm What was all that bars chatter back there a second ago? What are you guys talking about? Nothing. Don't worry about it. <laughs> wow. I'm worried about it. Just nothing. Just nothing. Didn't. Nope. Need to know only. Yeah. Wow. I got ears on the sides of my head. I think your tether's literally going to come right over the top of that. You want me to stop? Is that what you're saying? No, you're okay. Yeah. Okay. It's just like the way it's laying is very annoying. Roger, annoying. All right, is this our last pass here? Yeah, I think so. I think we got all sides pretty confidently as we go we're down. We're at 2269, so we're good to go. Okay. Uh, where are we going? All right, Just let's come straight up for now, please. Okay, yeah, Roger, yeah. coming up. Yeah. Our next task is to go pick up the broadband seismometer. Roger. Which is marked on ROV nav yes. as old BBS. Old I believe BBS. It is. Old BBS temporary. Let's tell a partial zoom on, pilot. Uh, you can do whatever you want. Eh? Uh, thanks. <laughs> Let me get you over there. <laughs> okay. I regret. <laughs> All right. <laughs> do less. Do west. <laughs> do, do more with less. Turn my scopes off. Get my do exposure less or back do to west. normal. What is happening? This is the worst. Okay. okay. Hold on it's here. got a mind of its own. This. Okay, I'm still coming up very slowly. Roger. Yep, you're good. Okay. Uh, I can still go. I oh, know that's how it went. All right, so we just wanted to go straight shot. Do we need to inspect anything on the way there? Or no. can I just get us over there? You can just get us there. Okay, us so there. we're going over here. So and I will move the ship there. And I'm going to go above all this stuff, basically? Yeah, we're just going to get over there as quickly as possible. Um, Is there a depth that I like? Like, what's the tallest thing around here? That uh, one in front of you. Is it that I think one? that was it, yeah. All right. And, Science, can we stop recording the... Uh, uh, DSC. You definitely can, yeah. Yep, and the still cam intervals are stopped now, too. Great, yes, thank, thank you, man. I'm going to go seven zero meters, bearing zero five <coughs> one. Bridge, now. <laughs> Step seven zero meters, bearing zero five one. Seven zero meters, seventy meters. Zero five one. Thank you. Well, will that work? And we'll just have to do some reacquiring once we get. Once we're clear of this, we can come back down and go on the bottom. But just get away from here. Just making sure auto depth is working right. Yeah, it seems okay. Okay, you want me to head what, zero five one? Uh, yep, zero, zero, six, zero. zero five one. We're going to this old BBS temp location here. Okay, I'm on my way, Dave. Zero five one.
Nothing in sonar. No. BB, old BBS. Old BBS. Right, not quite up there. Thank you. Okay, so for our imaginary turn counter, are mm -hmm. we turning Atalanta to port? Dave, well, I'm going to start pulling him eventually if I can. Yes. Yeah. Well, maybe not. So he's going to turn to starboard if I do that. Right? No, he'll turn to port. That's the that's Atlanta's facing that one. I know, but isn't it butt to butt? So if I start pulling that way, he'll get help. Oh face yeah, that yeah, way. I understand what you're saying. I don't think we need to get to. You're correct, and we shouldn't pull him. I don't think. We shouldn't pull him. No. You think the ship will pull him over? Yeah, the ship. It, it'll. Okay. I don't think you can pull it faster than the ship will get you there. <laughs> <laughs> Might as well wait for it. All right. Roger. Unless you need to do it for turns purposes, okay. which I don't understand quite well. <laughs> yeah, Can we not clear any of these snail trails up? What's that? <laughs> Can we not get rid of the snail trails? Yeah, you know, uh, <laughs> this is <laughs> this is a complaint with this software. Is that it's very unclear. Scientist Tom Kwasishna uh, would like to pass along his thanks to the whole van for the work we did on the photogrammetry. Welcome. Thanks, yeah, Tom. Yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing the result. Yeah. Uh, let me get rid of Argus's, at least. Let's we'll start there. did turn to port, hey Dave, with uh, Argus? I just turned to port there, yes. Okay, roger that. I don't know if that's correct or not, though. Okay. Mm -hmm. Is anybody's guess? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We'll just spin it out at the end of the season. But looking at the umbilical just there, uh -huh. eh, I think maybe no. Mm. Okay. But I don't know what was done before our shift. Sure. I think we're pretty well clear if we want to reacquire bottom and oh. go along. Oh, okay. It's up to you though, whatever you want to um, do. So there's nothing, this is all standing up high Mothra stuff and this is flattish? All, yeah, all let, let's stuff? see, all of this is shifted down here, I'm trying to, so if that's there, then you're essentially driving up here in this, in this area, so I think you're okay. Okay. Shouldn't be anything, um, but we can slowly, cool. we'll watch everything. Just w given how nav is, I want to make sure we're not flying past it and wondering where we are. And all Just that. given how nav is, yeah, sure. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to start coming down slow, Dave. Given how bad yep, I am at no my bother. job. <laughs> given how terrible I am at my job. <laughs> I'll set up every fail safe along the way <laughs> because I am sure to screw it up. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we'll just watch our uh, Atalantis sonar. It should be uh, clear is that to the the weight, or is that the football float? Is that the weight? W uh, where you want to zoom? Uh, right there. Oh yeah. Uh, just in the Atalanta camp. Yeah. I'm yeah, yeah. I see it. Can't tell. Coming to you. Roger. I got 25 meters to go to bottom. Just there. That looks like a weight, but okay. I could get you a zoom there. Do Might need to tilt there. down. Okay. All right. Yeah. Where are you going? Me? You? Yeah. Just dragging him. I'm dragging him. 
spinning them around. Am I pulling you around? Yeah. Well, I'm, too, I'm too impatient. That's okay. Don't worry about it. <laughs> okay, I won't. Let's just start pulling up on the winch, get you back. That's yeah. just quite... Okay, I'm, I stop moving forward, I'm just going down. Okay. And Atlanta's still clear enough? Uh, it's it's getting to be the northern extent of that, so Roger. once we're past that, I think. Pull a little bit more forward. Yeah, I think it's just because we're. Yeah. I'm still facing you. That's all. Have we paid out enough on the winch that we're past that little bump on the forward side? Bump on the oh. Uh, I don't know. Huh? I don't know. It might start lower. I'm kind of seeing a little shadow of it. So oh, okay. Oh sure. yeah yeah yeah. To, uh, it's hard to know how deep that goes. Winch is way over this side. Yeah, there it is. You see it? In the winch? Yeah. Is that what you're talking about? The little, yeah, it's, yeah, it's still the there, little so bump. it must be deeper. <clears throat> how deep did we go on uh, Shakedown 2? Like 32? Can't recall. System I'll have to check again. Dave had a, a, a phone call sync with Mr. Robertson yesterday. I passed along your message and he found it quite funny. You did? Yeah. Oh, good yeah. man. Yeah. Got a uh, bottom end porch view there. Roger. Probably crying in his chamomile tea. Yeah, uh, in his poke bowl. 26. Four good. Okay, looks like the ship's about in position, just about, so we'll just have to wait for Adelaide to catch up. Two green. A little Roger. smoke in the in the Atlanta view, but uh, I, don't, I think we're fine. It's just a Five, residual. six, Roger. seven, eight, nine captions. Good and good. Audio check. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's good. Salvos are good. Temps are good. System health check done. Show up on sonar. Oh, I see. I think it's that's this one actually. Let me see what I got going on. I might have to bump a little further because I think I was going off. Of, I thought that that was with that, but it's with this one. But we'll be still over there. So this is just the the old BBS we're putting on. And I think it's far away from everything. I think they've dragged it up north. Okay. What's that? Got it that? there? I don't know, it's a thing. Mm, something. That might be the... Stuff. Stuff. Yeah. It's like science stuff. Yeah. What are you? Found it. Is that it? Is that it? Look at that. Good thing That's you told it. me to go to the bottom, right? Yeah, otherwise we will oh. <laughs> See, look what I'm doing, setting myself up. <laughs> See? It makes it look like I know what I'm doing. I will 
here's a literal attaboy for you. Great work, attaboy. Nav. Attaboy. Sure. Attaboy jam. <laughs> <laughs> So we're picking this thing up? Yeah, it's got to come on the porch. It's got two connectors and like 20 meters of cable. So oof. the connectors are kind of tied together, but like you probably want to get them both on the porch. Mm. And the any loopage away from the from the rock, I would imagine, for yeah, when we pull up. Yeah, what's going on with that loop de doop well, it's just because we were sort of setting down. We had, we had, um, how did we have it? We had the BBS in one arm and the connectors in another, and we sort of set down. They sort of tumbled down the hill. But that's not important. So. Where's my telestrator pen? At the end of your arm. My digit? Yeah, it works just as well. Oh, I like the pen though. What are you <laughs> telestrating? Well, wouldn't you like to know? Well, yeah, that's why I have. <laughs> yes, totally <laughs> <I> would. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> so, we've got to get our hands on that. Okay. Uh -huh. Which we probably, I don't know if we could do it from a position. Uh, if we are here. Mm. Like, can we land here, pick this up, and then Thinking. rotate so. and get the other two things? Do we want to undo the loop around the rock? Because are we going to be flying up? I was just going to fly it off. Okay, yeah, I yeah, think yeah. you can fly it off. It's okay. not really hooked. It's not, okay. It's I'm not particularly <coughs> worried about it. It's it's all spiral wrapped. And um, Atalanta should still continue to give, give you better... Uh, more umbilical, so if you're fighting now, yeah, it'll Roger. go away. That is going to be a very long reach. Maybe. So we're going for that farthest thing first there. Yeah, I think that makes sense. Okay. I can't get any more over. How do you work this thing? This is cool. Nice. <laughs> hey, I, I don't like this game. I don't know how to play. Do you know how to play? Oh yeah, we got it. <laughs> okay. Roger. Future is now. Okay. Well, gave up on that. Pretty quick. Can you not reach it? Did I not get you close enough? You want a little push? You do, you do have quite a bit more on there. Or not quite a bit, but some. Let's see. Roger. Yeah, just figuring. 
some stuff. What are we going for, the strain relief or that parking position? The parking position. Okay. The white. Yeah. It zoom it's, help it's attached here? To, um, to a cable, but... Uh, yeah, you got it. Jaws, that up. one. Oh. I'm just figuring out where the jaw is with my hands because I'm trying something a bit different. Oh, there we go. He's got it. Oh, that's a Williams group, though. Man, everybody knows that, hey? Well, hopefully Dave will take it and spread it around the world. <laughs> Looks like you're dragging a rock with you. Oh, where's it going? So we're going to have to have one arm on the BBS and the other arm maybe just like, because uh, like there's three things that we're going to be carrying up with us and we only have two arms. So I don't know if you think we can sort of put it on the porch and then pin it with the BBS. So, well, it's just going to dangle, right? If we don't, like if it falls off, it's not going anywhere, right? Yeah, that's true. It's just we usually try to like keep the sure, characters on Sure, but it's as not well. the, the most important thing is the BBS. Yeah, being for sure. So we should keep then, the BBS in the craft. Well, hold on. Yeah. We don't like coming up live, right? With that craft. They yeah. Turn, we like turn on off hydraulics. Okay. We have to ask Trevor if that's okay. Where'd he go? He's here. I walked back row. Can the craft come up live holding onto the BBS? Okay. Okay, well that's, I mean that's fine, if what we want to bring it up pinned with the Magnum. Do you want the connectors on the porch or is it okay if we just bring them up dangling? You don't care? Alright, well if that's the case, you if that's the case, just, I would just drop that. Put them in the box and close the lid? I don't know. Yeah, you can do that. No, I don't know. It's just in the past we've usually brought up so it's half as much cable kind of coming up over the side. You're right, Dave. Yeah. Where do they want it? Okay. Not sure yet. That's fine. Yeah, so we're going to leave the connectors dangling. So we'll pick up, you can just drop that, and then we'll pick up the BBS. Great job picking it up. Just drop it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. No, but it's down here now. That's where we want it. Right. Okay, so before we pick up the BPS. Yeah, I'm just going to come up and out the way a little. Locked. Oh. So we're gonna put the magnum yeah, sure. on it, but we need to okay. get the magnum out of the way a bit first, maybe. Okay, give me. Oh, we can't shoulder up this. With that. Huh. Yeah, it's totally fine. Yeah. We'll pin it with the Magnum. Okay. Why don't you like bringing it up with the hydraulics live? Why? Yeah. Uh, it's <sighs> That's why? You don't, you don't have to answer that. Oh, okay, well, um, did you shoulder up? No. Hey, did we get that shoulder back? Maybe we both press it. Yeah. Reddy yeah. hasn't pressed it yet. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Quick. Were you just doing that too? I wasn't doing anything. No, 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 I didn't touch it. I was just doing shoulder up, but it doesn't work. Um. Okay, so we got to put the big ball on the porch with the right arm, and then with the left arm, we have to secure it on somehow. Okay. 
Yeah, I'll, I'll go get that. I'll go put you in a position where you can use your arm, so stand by. I'll put you in a position for success. <clears throat> Or, you know, a bunch of debris. Bunch <laughs> or dust the area. <laughs> See that handle back there? Can you telestrate the handle, please? I'm on it. There it is. Yeah. It's like a, a bar like that. Oh, no. <laughs> well, you got, got, you know. I tried the freeze one. There you go. Got to work for I gotta go print out AJ's got, got uh, Telestrator certificate, yes. yeah. master class. Enhance. I was I was playing with the settings yesterday, Ed. I was trying yeah. to get it to. It has like sports. Oh no, those didn't get loaded, did they? Oh yeah, they did. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah, it takes like 30 minutes to reset those. <laughs> what do you mean? Uh, the the tools are stored in a place it's hard to get to from there. That's all right. Nice. I was just clicking buttons. Yeah. Had the 2019 Chicago Bulls roster. Yeah. Nice. Uh, did you see there was a uh, work. Uh, perfect game in baseball yesterday? Really? Yeah. The 24th one. Super cool. A what game of baseball? Perfect. Oh. Exciting. Another Williams. Oh, well, maybe not. Thank you. Get me out of harm's way. Lovely. You can freeze that. Now we're going to try to use uh, Mango to pin this, and if we can't, then we'll have to use the craft. So. Don't have any carabiners there, do we? Uh, stand by. Unless you want to do it, dude. We can fight each other. You click, I'll click. We have a cinch Really? Really? Can't see the porch. Might be, a, might be a critical thing to see. Just wonder if I can get the hand on that. Well, I'm kind of wondering if you with the craft can orient the handle in a way that I can get the jaw on it somehow. Mm -hmm. I don't know, that's the only way I can think of without. Uh, and then just like tuck it in. Yeah. Yeah. Like a, like a six year old. Yeah. I can't Wait. see how it's oriented on the porch, but I don't want to mess with his arming. So it's kind of slipping off the yeah, lip. Yeah, it's slipping off the lip. Okay. This guy just... <laughs> Yeah. Read the room, man. We're kind of busy.
Nice. Well, and I got a we got a rest on the porch uh, too. Um, let me see what I can. Yeah, let me see what I can do. You can freeze if you'd like to. Uh, hmm. No shoulder up, hey? Okay, let's go like this. It's gonna take a while, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> it's not like this is expensive. Dollar. <laughs> Dollar a sec. Okay. No rush. Looks like you're dribbling. No. I know the answer. <laughs> yep.
Hmm. Oh, no, no. Don't do it. Little tap. Got it on bubble. Oh, close. I think it does. Is it looking bubble? How far down does this go? Well, actually, that lip may prevent it. Hmm, lip prevention. Even if it goes, nope, that stops there because of the rid the ridges on the sphere. Yeah, I see that. So knowing this, I much, think it's yeah, I think it's asymmetrical. I think it would go further on Can the connector side, which side we probably don't want it to go. <laughs> okay, neat. Neat. Well, you could grab the base of it. Yeah, there's that base plate, but then it'll kind of sit on its side. Grip lock, what's that like? Could you, uh, actually the base plate might be able to be gripped by Mango. It's got some holes in it, some handleage. As is long as you think it's strong enough. How, how well is that base plate secured? It's a good question, it's a question yep. for science. Yeah. You're gonna give me some wrist yeah. up? It's bolted on pretty well. Okay, so theoretically, if we were to get a handle on it with the jaw. If you bring that hand right the down to the porch. The only thing is it's a little thin, but you can just see what it does when you grab right. it. Right, we also have um, strap. We do have a strap, yeah. But we could possibly, you know, take some time and secure it. Yeah, and if you roll the, if it's touching the porch, then if you roll the jaw, I think we'll be okay. Or wrist roll, I should say. <coughs> and ready on close go ahead and close yeah that looks good to me nice I'm just cool. giving it a practice tug here yeah it seems <laughs> fine do you want to strap it in also probably yeah yeah you yeah yeah great so it just applies left. constant hydraulic force to it Hey, Ed, can I go full super double extra wide on Herc Zeus, please? Thank you. Full oh, oh, super double extra wide. Can't see. Where is can't that? Uh, no, can you let me up on the little poly line on bubble, please? I don't know. Is this worth it? Is this worth cinch strapping? It'll only take a couple minutes to get that cinch strapped in, yeah? I think this is the one I want, or is the other one the one I want? Let me check the photo. This is why I take photos. There's two there's two different ones. There's one on the outside and one on the inside. One's for cinching and one is for the other thing. Wait. Releasing. This was a dive or two ago, it was rigged up. This is right here. Okay. Uh, I want the outboard one. I do not want I want the yellow one, which is the one the other side of the magnum. Perfect. So I'm going to re-grab this. We're going to let it go with the magnum. Unless we don't want to cinch strap it. I don't know. Oh, wait. What? You can't get around to grab that loop? Uh, I have to get it. I have to grab it on this side to pull oh, it. Oh, you have over. to grab it on that yeah. side. <clears throat> I don't know about that. AJ? Is this good enough without the sin strap? I don't know, like, if the hydraulics are on, are you pretty confident that the arm's not going to go anywhere? The arm's not going to go anywhere, and once we're on the surface is where we kill hydraulics. Um, what about mangoing? Can, I know you don't have shoulder, but can you... As soon as you turn the hydraulics off, it's going to sag. Yeah, like, I'll show you right now. If I do that, the shoulder stays still but the rest just sags down. Um, Trevor. Hello. Can you get the loop on the side that you want without being able to move Mango's shoulder, <coughs> but in, can you like elbow yeah, up no, absolutely. and then grab it yep. without letting go of the sphere? Oh, maybe. Could do that. I think I like the elbow down idea. If you elbow down right now, it might give you enough space to pull her free. Yeah, I. You know what? Maybe I just try to pull it all forward. 
Yeah, stay there a sec. I'm just getting cozy with the handle of this thing. Yeah, Burp. there you go. Cozy. You can tip the handle because the handle yeah. doesn't need to be straight up. Let me just use my armpit and tip the handle. Uh -huh. No, that's not. That's not, you <laughs> that's not how it works. How do you move this oh thing? Oh man, guys, this is silly. Yeah. Okay. Just. I don't know if that bought you any more room. Yeah, but at least I can push it now. <gasps> oh, bend. Yeah. Mm, I don't like that. Please don't. Maybe it was the Please don't. Place. Sorry. Yeah, oh, yeah. kind ish. Yeah, sure. Yep. Okay. Nice. Now you're kicking. Now I'll just catch the connector. That's fine. Yep. If you're going to smash something, make sure it counts. Uh, handle? Still, just still protected the connector. Go away. <laughs> there we go. Okay, well, we'll try this out. Okay, can you elbow up anymore? Yeah. Sorry, I, I meant to say elbow down. My bad. I'm going to try and floss this out from underneath the thing. Okay, you're good there. Hey, look at that flossage. Yeah. I'm on the wrong side of the connector now, but that's not the end of the world. Or a cable, I should say. But. Where's the pulse set up? On the port side. Okay. It's the other poly line over there. Oh, nice. I left this really loose because it was originally rigged for two unknown size CTDs. So it's really loose. Yeah. Which was, is fine. That was day one. Yeah, man. Oh, it feels like um, forever ago. What is the best way to put it? Just like this, maybe, for now. Cinch it a little bit and come back to it. Yeah, if it stays on the handle, it might be nice. We'll find out. As long as it's not pinching the connector. But it Pinch looks like it'll behave. You again. Oh, yeah. I remember you. How? Yeah, can you go inboard and... <laughs> maybe not. <laughs> can I go here? No, and outboard. Yeah, go away. But don't work in, try it out. <laughs> That's the wrong button. There we go. Hmm. It's in my blind spot. See them. I know what you're s elbow mm. the other way. Yeah, like this. Uh, the shoulder azimuth is not locked either. It's just shoulder elevation. Mm. I think I can reach this. Come on. Come on, work with me here. Come on. Yeah, come on. If you go just for the clasp and not the... Yeah. Oh, fingertips. Yeah, I see what you're doing. Come on. Come on, baby. <laughs> mm. I'm like sucking it in over here just <laughs> as if I'm the sphere. Skinny thoughts. Come on, there you. Yeah, that's yeah, it. That's it. Got it. Okay. That's cinching. So I'm just going to pull it to here. Can I get that in bubble? That uh, strap, please? That polyline? Will the handle hold it? Okay, I've let it go. You let it go. Um, Maybe I want to do a bit more before I let it go. Okay. That's good there. Yeah, I love it. When was the last time you guys cleaned your bubble cam? Mm. It's on the inside. It's what's on the inside that counts. Unless you undo it. What if... Nope. Roger. You could put the strap on the other side of the connector and on the handle. Kind of similar in orientation, but on the other side of the connector. Yeah, I'm grabbing the holderator here thing. Yep. So, oops. 
Careful, watch. So where do you want to see this? I was thinking on the far side of the connector and on the handle, but I'm open to suggestions here. Yeah, of course. I'm just confused about its path. Like, where does it go from there? It's just oh, a straight shot. Oh, yeah, yeah, there you go. It's uh, okay. tied on the left side, yeah. tied on the starboard side. I think it's fine. Like, you can go across the handle and then across, like, in one of the ridges down the left side of the sphere. Mm -hmm. And it'll just okay. sit preferably on the far side of the connector so that it's mm -hmm. not pinching the cable. Yeah, Roger. Yeah, Roger. Got it. I can't guarantee where that yeah. handle's going to end up. That's nice. I mean, the, the orange metal handle thing. But uh, we'll see, I guess. Yeah, it shouldn't, I, it shouldn't really move, I don't think. Belt and suspenders recovery. Nope, swing and a miss. There we go, tightening, tightening, tautening. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah. I like it. Yeah? Jaws yeah. locked. Yeah, I think okay. that's good. Give it a little nuzzle here just to see. Not bad. Do we look at our pile to make sure it's not... Yeah, we can watch that as we come yeah. up. <coughs> it's going to be, we carried it over, it's going to be a snarl fest. Yeah. Um, I think the strap needs to be tighter. I think yeah, I need to cinch that it. one more time. So like, if you see, whoop, not like that, you don't. If you see right uh, here, mm -hmm. see how the strap goes back in? Yep, and it then it in. eventually goes over to here on the porch. Mm -hmm. So it's being pulled in by these cables. As I tighten the cinch strap, these cables will just kind of push, push over the starboard. Yeah. I think that's gotta happen. Okay. Mm -hmm. I just don't want you to like bend the handle. No, I I think the strap will break before that happens. So let's pull it till the strap breaks, then back off a bit. Yeah. Then we'll tie a knot. Yeah. Bowl under early. Just, there's nothing I like more than tying a knot in these straps. Yeah. Oof. So next time you grab the strap, make sure you grab it. <laughs> I did. I just slid out. <laughs> <laughs> next time, try grabbing it. Yeah. All right, Roger. Oh, yep, look, as expected. Yeah, that's fine. There you go. Okay, that's all I want to do. Oh, it goes right. Yeah, so these cables are just tightening it. So before I let it go, are we happy with this? It did yeah. relax a little bit. So yeah, I can do one more. Yeah. I'll we'll keep an eye on the handle. Yeah. I'm pulling quite hard now, so okay. I don't know that yeah. I want to go much more. Yeah. All right, I trust you on that. Okay, I'm going to let this go on the porch where it won't stay, and then uh, I'm going to stow the arm, or do you want to do something with the bundle? I, I missed that conversation, sorry. No, I think it's all going to dangle. Dangle? Is that, is that right, AJ? Yeah, it's all going to dangle. Mm, can I see the hose on bubble, please? I bumped free. I am side left. Um, sorry, the nozzle on the hose. Oh. Yeah, I do. Thank you. Yeah, strap. <laughs> Weave it around the strap. Holy. Okay, just mm -hmm. stop with that. Yeah, agreed. Get out of the way, you. Go down. Yeah, you're right. I gotta grab it differently. Recovery. Preparation.
Well, and you got it under that thing, too. I was hoping that I could do it all in one. It did not work. It bit me. It's not worth the... Bummer, man. I'm trying to smear, it's not working. Okay, there? Yeah. Okay, good enough. <clears throat> Arm's dead. And, uh, sorry, okay, yeah, back up a sec. Bundle, yeah, bundle. bundle of joy. What are we doing with the bundle of joy? Dangle. Dangle bundle? Yeah, Unless we're just going to let it dangle. I don't think we can do much slow and just watching it? Yeah. Are we ready to come up now? We'll yep, we're ready to come up. Jeb is going to handle the ascent. We've got some tasks for you with the, the plume sampler. And Kay. we'll also be doing a video transect of the top 1,000 meters. Video transect with all this nonsense on the porch? Yeah. Okay, Roger. Uh, so... <coughs> We will stay in this orientation for now so we can watch the cable dangle and then we will get into recovery formation in yeah. the water. Is that okay? Can you, I've lost the plot, can you remind me on which way we want to be going for, what's your best guess on tether wraps to port? Okay, you think that's going to be zero? Okay, Josh is back. I can, uh, yeah, I'll uh, come up. You want to go for lunch? Go for it, yeah. I'll get us set up here. We'll start the uh, McLean sampling at 2050 meters. 2050i. Yeah, and if you want to throw on that um, port, power port, I can get set up with the comms to the instrument too. Roger. Thanks. McLean is lights. Sure. John McLean? Yeah, that's what I said. Okay, it's talking to me. That's good. Great. What's it saying? It's asking me what year it is. What's like, up, G? Like Doc Brown. Hey. 1980. What do you want to know? <laughs> Can we look at the bundle with bubble? Yeah, can you look at the bundle with bubble? I can't use the... I'm no good at the game. Okay. <coughs> so, there is a... Just back a little bit more. Nope. Ah, great. How about over Spin here? Spin around wildly. Is that yeah, better? That's good. I think you missed it. Spin <laughs> <laughs> around wildly. Yeah, perfect. Yeah. yeah. So just watch like that the one controller uh, by I the prefer. craft. Yes. There's yeah, a right. little focus. That one's probably going to be one of the okay. last ones to come up. Yes. So we'll be pretty high up. Yeah. I'm not sure we'll still be able to see it. Maybe okay, I'll just we'll try and stay right over top of it. In bubble. Yeah. Can you come up on Delta, please? <laughs> Roger. Shut up, Ed. <laughs> Better? Worse? What was yeah. that? It's just Me cool. Light off. It's cooler. It's, yeah, it's super cool. <laughs> Dark Knight style. Yeah. yeah. And you got to turn to the right to face away from the ship eventually. I think I'm going to turn to the left. That's what... Uh, okay, you do whatever you'd like. I I just know that I flew this way and then turned right and sat down, or turned left and sat down, but... <coughs> okay, I understand, and right. I'm going to go left. Okay, that's right. Right makes yep. us... Yeah, yep. so we got to no put no a half turn in some way. Okay. We don't know if it's no going to be... Uh, yeah, we're guessing. Sure. But I understand what you're saying. If I turn right, it'll get us back where you found it. Yeah, where I started. Yeah. Raj. <laughs> Spin around wildly. <laughs> Just make this as not useful as possible. That would be swell. Whoa, okay, that's whoa. a little, oh, hello. A little too high on the old delta there. Is that deltometer? 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 Sorry. Sorry. Uh, I was pegged. Like, what could we have? Pegged. <laughs> pegged the deltometer. deltometer. Looks like that cable came free. Okay, Roger. We're going to have to replace that gauge. Well, Josh's uh, verticality stats are still <laughs> through the roof. <laughs> <laughs> no matter where he's sitting. Whether What's the he's length on, of this cable, on the arm or on the six 20 meters? <laughs> 20 meters. I'm going to keep going carefully until we're at 20 before I start Roger. up for ascent. Yeah, it is tangled, so, yeah, yeah. you know, could yeah. be 16. Likely. I don't know. 
doesn't hurt to wait another minute, 30 yep. seconds. Josh is using the PTZ controller on the winch. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna hand you guys over to Jeb. See you, AJ. Bye, AJ. Hey, Jeb. Bye, AJ. Cheers. Ahoy. Great shift, Ahoy. guys. Okay, I'm 18 meters, 19 meters off bottom. I'm gonna call that cable good. 20 meters off bottom, so I'm gonna set up for recovery now. Roger. <clears throat> Let me know when you want Atlanta auto head off. Roger. We can keep coming up too because who knows how coming up bumpy this is. Coming up, just not a thousand meters a minute. Yep, and we're not doing any plumage sampleage until two zero five zero. Hey Jeb, what's up, Trevor? Is there a spot in particular you want me to be for this plume sampling, or is anything at two 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 zero five zero where we are now that's sufficient? Hmm, interesting. It doesn't say in the dive plan. <laughs> Great. Okay. I'm gonna chat with the PI, but for now, let's say straight up. Straight up, Mirage. I think it's diffuse enough, but I'll confirm. Yeah, I'm guessing above the thing in general is probably pretty good, but let me know. All right, here we go. Jeb, are we starting yeah. now? Did or we Yeah, I got it. That's I'm scary. ready to go. Or in 200 meters, I can't remember what you said. Oh, uh, we're, I'm going to start the pump at 2050 yeah. meters. Oh, okay. And, and okay. we're going to do a 10 meters per minute ascent at that point. It's by oh. radio. Okay, You're sounds good. Listening yeah. to radio? Yeah. Okay. No, I'm hearing your beeps. Beep boop. <laughs> beep beep boop boop boop. Beep boop beep beep. <laughs> uh, maybe if I turn my volume down. And Steve confirms nope. we're going to go straight up, guys. Stop. It needs to not happen anymore <laughs> by radio. So, short yeah, confirms. You can slow down and catch up. <laughs> you want me to slow down? Yeah. And I'm you're right. Are you going to come to zero, Delta? I'm 100% come to zero, Delta, yeah. I'll stretch Is that out. what we're doing? Yeah, man. Yeah, buddy. Okay. We're out of here. Even though we got to take a sample, we're doing that anyways? Uh, plume sample's autonomous, or jeb autonomous, and uh, <laughs> it's got to be in the right spot. <laughs> jeb autonomous. We'll think of something that rolls off the tongue a bit better. <laughs> Gematically. Yeah, I like that one. <laughs> Where's the stick of destiny? There it is. Can you get it? Can I get it? Thank you. Go fetch. <laughs> okay. Hey, Trevor. Hello. <laughs> We're also going to trigger the remaining Niskins at 1980 meters, but I'll let you know when we get there. 1980 meters. Yeah. Hey, hope we can reach them. Towards the end of the uh, McLean sampling Ra run. So I'm going to start coming up and keep the zero delta. Sounds good. Okay. I'm coming up at 18. And I don't have depth on my display here, so just give me a shout when we're close to 2050. 2050, Roger. You could probably pull up a. You got another. Mo oh. Yeah, I'll get it. Yeah, you got 74 monitors over there. Okay.
all set at the work table. There's always beans. Watch change it video. Roger. Cheers. Thanks. <clears throat> well, this auto head off, is it just... Uh, now, yeah, sure. Yeah, go for it. Okay, auto heading off on Atlanta. There's a lot of talking going on. Yeah, they're watch changing. It's the mass watch changiest time. It's nice not having the same watch change as everybody else. I love it, yeah. You can keep the keep the thing moving. Get the gym, because nobody's using it. Yeah, right, totally. Hey, Jeb, we're at 2175. I'm still in some random place that's near things, but I'm not in anywhere other than that. Have you found any details from the PI? Uh, yeah, we got confirmation from shore that straight up is perfect. Okay, straight up is not completely above everything, but it's within tether range, so hopefully that's good enough. <coughs> yep, we're good with straight up. Thank you. Coming up fast. Yeah, you're coming up very fast. 25. Seems wild. Did you see on the whiteboard? They get a planned recovery time or a planned next dive time or anything? Yes. What's what's the details? Next dive around 6 p.m. Okay. And it's a 24-hour plus long dive at Endeavour. Okay. Thank you. It's going to be a quick turnaround. Yeah. 6 p.m., yeah. Do you have to move so fast? Yeah. Um, so I'll go for lunch at some point and, uh, Dave can sit here, you can pull Niskins mm -hmm. and then when I come up, I'll relieve you and we'll have Dave fly recovery. I think that'll be his first flown recovery. Okay. Cause I'll just go to, go to deck. And then, uh, I think last time I was here, he was there. Yeah, I understand. Yeah. Makes sense to me. The next time I'll go on deck and you guys can be up here. <clears throat> and then next time. She can fly the ROV. I'll be Ed. Ed can... Ed will run the oh, crane. Ed's gone. <laughs> Ed will run the crane. Ed will be the swimmer, the diver. <laughs> yeah? T. Do T. <laughs> what? Ed's not here. Uh, Pete's here for video. This is Pete. Hey, Pete. Good morning. Hey, Pete. <laughs> I Hi, know Pete. it's like our morning, right? Because we just woke oh, up. Oh, it's not the morning anymore. No, it's not. <laughs>
Happy Thursday. Is that what day it is? <laughs> to Pete? I don't know what day it is. It's Thursday. All I know is I left and it was morning. I was told it was Thursday. <laughs> <laughs> I was told. Oh no, I was under the impression it was Wednesday. Let's look at stuff. Oh yeah, we're not stopping, right, Jeb? Uh, no, but we are going to slow down. Right right. What 10, speed do you want? We'd like 10 meters per minute starting at 2050 meters. Okay, I will do what I can. <laughs> That's appreciated. We're at 2056 right now. You have depth readout now, is that right? I can see it back here, yeah. Great. <coughs> So, Jeb, we're sampling, we're taking samples of Niskins? Uh, we're going to do that towards the end of this little stretch. We're going to start with pulling the water through a filter and attempt to catch some of the materials that's in the hydrothermal vent bloom. Okay, great. Yeah. This is for uh, Hannah Robutka at UVic. She's online right now keeping an eye on things. Killed my momentum, and now I'm at zero meters a minute. That's not what you want. That's super. <laughs> I was going way too fast, so. No, I know. And then I slowed down way too much, so, you know. We need a little more warning. I had plenty of warning. Jeb warned me as we were on the bottom. <laughs> no, that we had to slow down, though? Oh. That's what I meant. Maybe. The plan was uh, I think it's in the dive given plan. to you, but, you know. Yeah. I read the dive plans weeks ago. I read them I last year. I have no excuse. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you do. Uh, it's a lot of information. It's hard to remember every detail. <laughs> Thank you, Megan. Yeah. That was awesome. Thank you. Hey, we're okay. at 2049. I'm so coming up at 8 meters a minute. Okay. Two, I've already started the uh, pump running. Great. Let me try and dial it into 10. But uh, Yeah, and hang out at 10 until we get to 1975 meters. But before the end of that, we're going to do a uh, Niskin at 1980. Roger, 1980. Yep. You can get set up for that anytime, Josh. Whenever you want now, later, I don't care. Do what you do. <coughs> Niskin cam, it's, it's active. Are you ready? Wrong. Okay, Wrong. the controller's telling me we're pumping at six liters per minute. It's been running for about a minute. I suppose you want down light back on. Thank you. Light's coming on. Roger. Whirp. Whirp. So what do I got to pull? Not the five and six. One. That's a question for the dive chief. Well, we pulled one through four. How many Roger. do we have? Six. We have six. Well. We pulled one through four, then we probably want to pull at least five and six. Probably one. I've got a note here saying that there should be two left. Yeah. That's correct. Thanks, buddy. Okay, we're down to about five liters per minute. Still going after 95 seconds. 10.0 meters a minute. What? <laughs> I tickled the. <laughs> I tickled the ball. Don't. <laughs> no, it's more of a me or Ed thing to do. Mm -hmm. How are you guys liking the uh, 3D printed Niskin poles? Uh, they're great except for one. One was really lame. Mm. One was our least favorite. What was different about that one? It's location. Oh, that's fair. <laughs> it has nothing to do with the ball itself, though. Mm, I don't know. You have to ask the. Uh, Maybe you can modify the ball to make one easier. Mm. Maybe less ball like, but more of like a hanging rod thing. Hey. Okay, the pump reached its minimum sampling rate, so I've restarted it, and we're going to go through this process throughout the. Uh, sampling interval. 
Mr. Jeb? Well, yes, sir. Are we stopping in 1980 to pull these two Niskins? Or you want to just pull one at like 1982 and one in 1978? I'm going to say for go now up. that we're going to stop, but I'll double check and get you an answer from shore. Roger. So in about 30 meters, we're going to stop, I think. Okay. Josh just heard back from shore. Hannah says, pull Veniskin's well ascending. One at 1982, one at 1978 is good. 1982 so and then 1978. So either side of what, a 1980. Roger, is somebody watching the Niskins that can tell me when they're pulled, please? <coughs> and I will ready. Oh, we got a little bit. Mm -hmm. What's special about 1982? Well, the goal is 1980, but we're going to do it on the fly, and I can't do both at the exact same time. I see, okay. So I gave myself four meters, which is pretty ambitious. That is ambitious. <laughs> Don't mess up. Thank you, whoever <laughs> said that. You're welcome. <laughs> Where's ball number six? Is that six or five? That's, That's five. five. It's like five. Okay, we can count, good. Right. Okay, the pump I'm looking for six. It's behind my finger. The pump has stopped again, okay. so I've restarted it for the third time. Roger. This is expected behavior. Yes, I will drop a waypoint. <laughs> Gonna call it there, Dave? Yep, as soon as I see it. If I see it, looks like it's a long way back. Oh, take so forever. much suspense. Nineteen eighty two. Can't see it, can't tell. You only need an inch. So it wasn't that ambitious. 1978. Should have, should have gone. And 1975, we're going to be done this job? Just getting it set up for another sample. I'll give you an answer shortly. Can I camera over? Okay. Uh, Josh, that was. 1978 you're asking about? Uh, Sorry. No, I was saying that 1975 we're kind of done the whole thing. We're we done the whole thing as long as we've got 10 minutes, 10 to 12 minutes of sampling, and I'm just adding up the uh, total okay. duration so far. Okay, we'll just keep going up at 10 meters a minute then. Yeah, we might go a little bit more. No problem. Okay, thanks.
Hmm. What's up? I know, I'm watching that too. That's not quite right. Well, y he wants you to keep coming up in the same spot. I don't feel like you've... Oh yeah, you're getting hits. Megan, is Atlanta really moving over there like that? Um, no. Okay. She hasn't moved at all. Where is she? Uh, she's right underneath us. It just doesn't correspond to what that shows. Right. Unless... That shows her back here somewhere. Uh-huh. Right? Because you're stretched out. Well, I'm stretched out away from you. Yeah. <coughs> Is the ROV yeah, getting it hits? Doesn't look like the ROV has been tracking. I think it, I've seen uh, it twitch and we're supposed to be coming up in no, the same. No, but I'm not seeing a trail for, oh. yeah, so we're well, still on dead rack. Oh, we're still on dead rack. That's what it is. Okay. Roger. That makes sense. There we go. There we go. That's what it is. Sorry about that. No worries. That's all right. Got all excited about those Niskins. <laughs> <laughs> yes. But that's that's actually probably wrong. So let me drop a new spot for where the ROV actually is. Um. Okay, I did the math. We're just wrapping up the last sampling run. So we're at 45 seconds. Once we get to 121, we'll have got the full 10 minutes. We'll go a little bit more to get the 12 Hannah's asking for, and then I'll let you know. Roger. Sounds good. Put that back on the cages. Hey, Sean, do you have a note of when I uh, first started the pump? I can work it out from here, but if you've got something, I'd like to double check. Yeah. Oh, sorry, Ulrike. <laughs> happy, happy. Yes, one moment. The pump was started at 19.07 UTC. No, that's not right. It was 19.04 UTC. Okay, thank you. And there's a bit of time lost each time I restart the sampling, so just give it a little bit more. Oh, they're right on top of each other. So it, it, it should be about the same. Yeah. No way. 
Check you out. Check you out. Check me out? Yeah. Doing my job? Yeah. I know. Mm -hmm. It's pretty the impressive. The paperwork <laughs> side of it. Oh. I can do it. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, total cumulative time sampling is 12 minutes, so we're happy with that. Ulrika, you can make a note, or any of the loggers that were turning off the uh, McLean sampler. So we can come up full speed? Yes, sir. And we'll stop at uh, 1,000 meters from the surface for the tra uh, visual transect. Sorry? Oh, we're going to do a transect from 1,000 up? Yeah. 